The Studio Live AI mixer is at the heart of this audio system. It's important to note that not all digital mixers are made equal, and just like speakers, mixers do sound different. The Studio Live has an amazingly powerful onboard computer and uses very sophisticated algorithms to process the audio. This means that your audience will notice a sound difference when using this board. While there are many key features to this mixer, we're going to talk about some necessary benefits for field audio. First of all, the Studio Lab has a very intuitive and easy to use layout. There is a physical fader for every channel and there's a physical knob and button for every feature that you need. So you're not digging through endless menus to try to find what you want and your faders aren't changing functions. At any point, if you want channel 6 to turn up, you move channel 6 up. It will never control anything else, so it's always right there for you to use. Another key benefit are these four subgroups. You can combine like instruments to a single subgroup fader. So if you want all of your drum set to be on one fader or all of your marimbas, xylos, or maybe your synths, you simply assign them to a subgroup fader and then you have independent volume control of that group. Another key benefit here is that you have metering for every single channel. So by simply switching from input to output, you can actually see the level of volume coming in and going out of each channel. This is really important when you're trying to set up quickly because I can actually line check to ensure I'm getting the right signal from every instrument in the front ensemble without ever having sound go through the speakers. Another benefit is wireless control. You can control this entire mixer from an iPad or a laptop computer. So whether I'm out on the field, in the stands, or way up on the scaffolding, I have control of this mixer. The next benefit we want to talk about is the ability to save overall settings for the board as scenes. This is really important because as I get my mixer set up in rehearsal, when it comes to showtime, I simply just scroll through scenes as the show goes so you get the same consistent settings for every show. You can even have a student or anyone in the pit simply go through and select scenes as you perform. One key feature about the scenes is you actually select which you want to save. A scene can be as easy as muting and unmuting microphones, it can be volume changes for certain faders, or it can be a complete reconfiguration. In the menu, you actually have control. One tip here, we would recommend that you do not save GEQ. What this is, is the overall EQ for the board. So as you scroll through scenes, you're not changing this. This way, when you go into a stadium, and let's say you have a lot of low end that's coming out, I can actually cut out that low end, and that change will affect every scene of the board. So you can actually dial in and make some changes during the show that will reflect over all your scenes. The Studio Live AI Mixer also offers a full software suite available for your laptop. This includes virtual Studio Live software that you can use to control the board from your laptop, capture recording software, which allows you to record everything from the board in one click, and smart integration, which allows you to see a virtual representation of frequencies. Now with capture, I can hit one click and record everything coming in the board. This is very beneficial when it comes to rehearsals because I can actually play back to the players immediately what they just played, or I can isolate certain channels and see, you know, for rehearsal purposes, who's lining up where. Another key feature about using Capture is that you can do what we call a virtual sound check. When you're trying to get all your mics and instruments dialed in correctly and you don't have time on the field with the whole marching band there, trying to get everyone quiet to set up, you simply record a whole run, play it back later, and use that playback to dial in and save your settings. This is very beneficial. Using smart integration, we can actually see a virtual representation of the frequencies coming in. So if I hear a muddy frequency that I can't necessarily identify, I can use smart to actually see where that frequency is and that'll help me clean up the sound very quickly. Another thing, since we're recording from the board, we can take two of our Audio-Technica Pro 37 microphones in a stereo pair, set them up right on the 50, so I get a good stereo image of all the horns. So I can multi-track all of the instruments in the front ensemble and get the horn audio from the field and get a great quality recording right from the board. Now that we have reviewed the key benefits of the Studio Live, let's take a deeper look at the Fat Channel Dynamics processing to help make your front ensemble sound amazing.